Hello, my name is Edward Tangchenob. I am a board certified minimally invasive surgeon here at West Covina, California, Citrus Valley Health Partners. I'm also the medical director for minimally invasive gynecologic and robotic surgery, Queen of the Valley Medical Center. What Citrus Valley Health Partners is committed to as an institution is providing options for our female patients. This institution-wide commitment is what allows us to be at the forefront of female surgery in the San Gabriel area. The hospital system has truly embraced this kind of surgery from the obstetrics and gynecology department to the highest levels of hospital administration and continues to remain committed to provide effective surgical options for today's modern woman. It is important to note that even minimally invasive surgery may come in three forms. This includes laparoscopic, robotically assisted laparoscopic, and vaginal. Vaginal hysterectomy is the original minimally invasive surgery in which the entire procedure is completed from down below. With recent advances in endoscopic cameras and computer-assisted technology, laparoscopic or straight stick and robotically assisted laparoscopic have modernized female surgery. We are also excited to offer cutting-edge single-site surgery and single-site hysterectomy. For some of our female patients, all the surgery can be completed through just the belly button with the incision completely hidden so that there is virtually no scar. Only a few hospitals nationwide offer this type of surgery and not all patients are candidates, so I would encourage you to ask your healthcare provider if you are a candidate for this procedure. We often hear many questions from women when it comes to minimally invasive surgery. One of the first common questions is, are you able to see just as clearly through a small incision as a large incision? The answer is yes. Modern endoscopic cameras are all high definition and the images are displayed in a three-dimensional manner to give surgeons a magnified and detailed view of the anatomy. Modern advanced imaging would be comparable to say taking a surgeon, shrinking them and placing them inside the patient. Since this can't actually be achieved, modern imaging is the next best thing. As minimal invasive surgeons, we can manipulate the camera around difficult angles, around adhesions, around bulky cysts or anatomy to allow us to complete the surgery through just the small incisions. How quickly can you get back to work? Well, the general rule of thumb is that you will begin to feel better, pain-wise at least, within the first few days, but by one to two weeks, you can resume normal life activities, granted no heavy lifting. I would say by no heavy lifting, I mean no heavier than a large dictionary. Citrus Valley Health Partners is sponsoring several community lecture events in 2014 for our patients to attend to gain more information about minimally invasive surgery. Minimally invasive surgeons from our hospital system will be giving lectures on minimally invasive options and techniques, so I encourage you all to sign up and attend one of the lectures in a location near you today. At CVHP, we want to empower our female patients to ask the question, can my surgery be done in a minimally invasive way? If you are interested in a consultation, please call 1-888-459-2847 today.